lots of plastic pipe and I ask what the flip are you doing with that Chris? Well, um, we're putting them inside our water tank. So when I was searching for water tanks it became apparent to me that much like if you drive your car with a big um, container of water it sloshes about but if you have 100 litres that's 100 kilograms sloshing about and it makes your car handle or van handle badly it can be a bit dangerous. So on really big water tanks, they baffle them, and that's to try and slow the water down and stop it moving as a unit. But you can't really find baffled water tanks less than 100 litres very easily. Uh, so even at 100 litres, they're all like massive, 150. So the plan is, get a load of drain pipe, cut it to size, and then wedge them in here. And when I did the maths, it turns out I need almost 20 meters of drain pipe, which is hilarious. But it's pretty light stuff, so we'll see how we go. And then, big fail, but it's only 30 quid, so it's worth trying. This is Mark 1. Um, so I want to drill holes, they're going to sit in the tank vertically. So I wanted to drill holes in the bottom to make sure that all the water flows out of each pipe and drains properly. So I'm going to go around and do that. It's a bit laborious to be honest because you need to drill them and then sand them to make sure no plastic uh, filings come off. I tried to do a bigger hole up here and it cracked the plastic and then also the square lines are harder to sand so we're going with little holes. And then because I need to cut about I think it's like 70 of these, it's ridiculous. I don't want to mark it out each time. So I've made a cheeky sled. All I have to do is slide a big length of pipe off onto the backstop and then it's exactly the right distance away from the grade and I slide it and then it cuts it at the right depth so that will make life a lot easier as I rattle through the ridiculous number of these it works, cheap baffling Right, I've been going at it for a good few hours now, and these are all I've got still to go in. Only the ones that I've done, it takes forever. What I'm trying to do is sand down all of the little plastic filings so it doesn't make the water disgusting. So I've tried to be inventive to make it a bit quick. Double sided sticky tape, my wet and dry paper onto the end of my drill, and I just shove that in the gaps to try and uh, save the old hand. But... sun so I started this at midday and it is now 20 to 10 it's a lesson of perseverance if anything oh my goodness I've still got to wash them so all the pipes are cut they're all wedged in uh, nice and neatly that is one very baffled tank flipping heavy now even without any water in this tank is a very thick tank anyway, it's quite a high quality tank, not that I particularly wanted that, but I was struggling to find one. And yeah, she's flipping heavy without any water in it, so I don't know, we'll trial it and if not, we'll have to come up with some other solution, maybe an under slung tank or something like that. 